What's going on guys? Great Shock here. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to restore these CDP Taxi 12s from 2008 that I picked up for $38. Some things we're going to do is give these shoes a deep clean, a repaint, re-glue, and attempt to restitch the back part of the sock liner. First up, I'm going to throw out these old laces and insert shoe trees to size. In a side-by-side -side comparison, you can see a noticeable difference. Using soap and a spray bottle, I'm going to give the shoes a light cleaning to hopefully get rid of all the grime. I sprinkled some detergent on the shoes in the mesh and the sock liners to help clean them. Then we can go ahead and place them in our sneaker laundry bags and put them on a cold cycle for 30 minutes. I also added more detergent to the machine to assist in cleaning power. After the shoes are dried, we can ensure they're clean and ready for the next step. To remove the creases on the midsole, I'll use a heat gun, and for the leather, an iron and a wet shirt. I also plan on ironing the tongues and lining so they return back to normal. The midsoles are easy to damage and separate, so keep it quick and simple. To prepare the shoes for a repaint, I'm using acetone to remove the factory finish. Before I repaint, I plan to re-glue any panels that were separated. Using a small brush, I apply the glue, let it dry for around 10 minutes, and then heat it up to around 140 degrees, that way it sticks together instantly. To remove any excess glue, I gently pass the cotton ball with acetone over the area. Using Angela's black and white, I'm now going to repaint the entire shoe.
To prepare the bottoms for a re-glue, I'm using acetone to clean off both surfaces. Just like before, I'm applying Barge Super Stick, but this time I'm doing two coats to ensure I cover every area, and then let it cure overnight. The following day, you can see we can put them together and they won't stick unless we heat it up. So the plan is to keep it aligned and heat up one session at a time. Now the sock liner is so badly messed up that I wasn't sure if I'd be able to fix it, but the plan is to use a needle and thread and try and patch it up. But basically I'm passing the needle back and forth very close together. I never attempted anything like this before but it was honestly way better than what I was expecting. My best advice is to take your time and follow the original thread lining. To remove any sock lint, I used a fabric shaver. Lastly, we can apply Krylon matte finisher, lace them up, and polish them using tire shine. There you have it guys, thank you so much for watching. Being that this is almost a 13 year old shoe, I'm really happy with how they turned out. Also shout out to Fear Fireshot, Gareth Noble, and everyone that watched the last video. If you liked the video, please drop a like, leave a comment, and until next time, take care.